Hey everyone. Um, so I am back today and I'm going to be doing um, not a tutorial. Tutorials are coming soon too. Um, after this video you'll be seeing a lot more tutorials. So watch out for that. Um, there will be more hair tutorials, makeup tutorials, stuff like that. So keep a uh, watch out for that. Okay, my hair is bugging me. So don't mind me if I play with it a lot in this video. Um, but this is, of course, going to be a self-tanner video. And I've come across five different kinds. So I'm just going to talk to you quickly about them. The first one, I the first two I don't have with me, actually. And they're both Neutrogena. And um, uh, it's not the Build-A-Tan one. It's can't really remember, but there's a foam one, and then there's a lotion one, um, but it's not the build of tan, um, but anyways, it's in tan, no, it's in fair to medium, and I kind of thought that that'd be good for my skin, because since the winter time came, I got a lot lighter, um, but I have realized that it actually didn't do anything to my skin, but make my skin look orange. Um, because it, I don't know, it didn't really do anything to me otherwise because the color was too light for me. Um, and, I mean, I actually really like the foam one for your face, but other than that, I really don't like those ones. Um, I want to try to build a tan one, so I have to go scooping around um, Winnipeg Dollaramas because Deanne... 5253 um, bought hers at a Dollarama in Winnipeg. Um, but I have to go and look around for that because, yeah, it's not here in the one I go to. Um, so anyways, the next one is the Nivea Visage. Looks like this, and I got this from Dollarama. This is in medium to ta medium to dark skin tones. Oh, I want to tell you guys right now, um, try to pick a self-tanner that is your color. Um, don't try to get medium or medium to tan if you really aren't that natural color. I mean, I know it's supposed to boost your color up a little bit, so you want something that's darker, but it actually might turn out too dark. So, um, like, if you're a fair skin tone, try to find fair to medium, because that will it will boost your color up a bit, um, but naturally, not so you look like fake. So, yeah, I got this one, and it's a daily moisturizer. Um, there's actually quite more after I use, okay, never mind, I won't even talk about that. But, anyways, yeah, this is a 24-hour moisturizer, and it has a little bit of self-tanning in it. Um, I use this every day and night on my face. It really moisturizes my face, and it doesn't smell bad. Um, the Neutrogena's do smell really bad, but this one doesn't, and it actually um, does give your skin color, which is really nice because you don't want to... I don't know. I kind of looked at this, and I was like, I don't know. It kind of seems like something that wouldn't give me any color, but it gives me a natural color, and you can build it up. Um, depending on how many times a day you do it. Um, but I don't really notice it in the daytime because that's when I have makeup on, so I can't really tell. But, yeah, I really like this one. So if you guys see this in a department uh, drugstore or even in your local Dollarama, pick it up because it works really good on your face. Um, the next one is the Jerkins Natural Glow Daily Moisturizer Revitalizing. Looks like this. And this is like empty now, but there's um, the color scheme. This is the the day you put it on, after seven days, after a week. Um, for this, for me at least, I did not see any color change with my skin. Um, but I did, it did, it does have shimmers in it, and it did give me a little bit of that glow in the sun. Um, it doesn't smell bad, uh, but other than that, it didn't give me any color. Um, it does moisturize your skin a lot, so if you, um, 
want to try this out for a moisturizer, it works really good. But for some people, it the tanning part does actually work. But for me, it just didn't for some reason. This is in medium to tan, by the way. And, yeah, it just didn't do much for me. So, I wasn't too happy with Jergens when I've been hearing raves about them. Um, but, I don't know, just for me, it didn't really work or do anything but moisturize my skin. Which I loved, first of all. But, if I would have known that it just would have moisturized my skin, I probably would have never got it. Um, just because I have a lot of moisturizers ready, so, yeah, but, I mean, it was worth trying. They're not too expensive. I think I got it for 7 or $9, I can't remember. So the next one I use, um, this is also in a spray form. I didn't get the spray form because, um, I just thought that it would run out really fast because it is a spray. So this one is the lotion form. This is the L'Oreal Sublime Bronze in medium. Looks like this. Um, yeah, I would say, like on camera, I look really light. But I'm actually not as light as I am on camera. Um, but this actually, it has tons and tons of glitter. I don't really want to put it on my hands. But if you guys can see that, it is dark. It comes out already a bronze color but this has tons and tons of shimmer on your skin and it will leave your skin full of shimmers but it actually reflects the sun so it makes you look even more tan because the sun makes you look lighter than you are so um, yeah it really um, makes you still look tanned because of the shimmers in it so it reflects the sun um, but I really, really am raving for this product. I really love this product. You can apply it that first day. Um, oh, and actually just doing this at night. Better than anything else. But um, when I woke up, the first day I put this on, I was so happy. I looked like I just went out tanning for three hours that day or the night before. And I just got like this big tan on my whole body. And... It works really good. I mean, you can't see it on my skin because light's coming in and hitting it anyways. But, um, yeah, it really gave me the color I want. And I'm so happy um, of the results of this. And this is only $9 or something. But there is a spray form. If you guys have tried that out or try it out, um, let me know how that is. Um... But yeah, I really do love this product. Um, I know there's an Aveeno one that I heard from my friend um, that I actually am probably going to try out. But I'm not going to do that yet until I'm done with this. Um, but I kind of feel safe with this product, so I don't know if I want to leave it. Um, but yeah, I really love this product. So go try it out. It's worth the money. Um, this will also last you over a month so you yeah I mean in the summertime I won't be using it as much because I might get a lot more tanned when I start going to the beach and stuff but I just have no time to be outside and if I am am outside I'm not outside for long I'm going out somewhere so um yeah I mean I really love this product just go try it out and let me know what you think about it um the problem about this is you really have to wash your hands off really good. The sparkles stick to your, the palms of your hand like crazy. But, um, yeah, it works really good. So, um, I highly recommend it, um, if you're looking for a tan. I don't know if there are different colors. I think there's just medium. Um, but there is one also that is, um, a one-a-day tan thing. So you put it on and you'll look tan for the day. And then you'll go in the shower and it'll all wash off. Um, so yeah, just let me know, um, what you guys think, if you guys, um, have tried this, but, um, yeah. So I will see you guys in my next tutorial video. Um, yeah, and I hope this didn't bother you guys from me talking forever, but, um, yeah, I'm gonna go now, and I will see you guys later. Bye.